All right, here we go, everybody. What's up? My name is Jose Trujillo. I'm an artist, and uh, I just wanted to I wanted to record this and show you. I'm I'm painting a little a little figure here with a, an umbrella. Very simple on this vertical canvas, and. Uh, It's just kind of make it playful, you know? You got to make it a little bit playful. Well, I like to make it playful anyways. Not everybody does, but I do. There's my little person. I might have them. There we go. Is that it? Yeah, I think that's it. There we go. Check it out. And then uh, put someone else down here, maybe a little child right here. Remember, children and adults have the same, <laughs> the same big heads. <laughs> like, mom, I want some meatloaf, mom. <laughs> Something like that, huh? Yeah. Okay, so now I'm going to start coloring in there. And, and uh, the way I'm gonna do it is very simple. Just use some primary colors and mix them a little bit, you know? Just mix some primary colors a little bit. Look at that, boom, baby. My question is, when is my little ass going to become famous on YouTube? <laughs> That's my question. And it might be never, huh? It's going to take a while. When are people going to get to, like, say, hey, do I know that cat? This is my ultimate dream. I'm driving. I stop by some store, you know, gas up. And then someone looks at me and says, are you the world's greatest living artist? And I'm like, oh my God, really? Oh, well, you know, I guess I am. <laughs> Stupid, huh? <laughs> I guess I am, I don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know? And then be like, would you like an autograph? And then the person be like, hell no, I hate your stupid channel. <laughs> <laughs> Me trying to be like, hey, would you, would you like a, you know, I assume you would want an autograph from the world's greatest living artist. And then just, just backfires and just blows in my face, you know, like, you hate your stupid channel. All the stuff you say is stupid. I'm like, oh man, what did I do wrong? <laughs> that's my, that's my, uh, my fantasy gone wrong. My fantasy gone wrong. <laughs> Look at this, man. Boom. I like how people tell me that I speak about everything here except art. <laughs> They're like, dude, you talk about everything except art. And I'm right. And that is why. That is why my channel is so unique. I wouldn't trade it for anything. Freaking hate talking about art. It's like... It's like, and now, happy little birds, happy little trees. It's like, it's annoying, you know? I want to talk about art. I just want to show up and, and like, just have a good time here with you guys. That's all. I already do too much art. My whole life is art, 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 art. Composition. Colors. Da, da, da. And people tell me, you know, like, when are you going to start talking about composition? I'm like, probably... Uh, probably never. <laughs> I just can't, guys. It's not my jam, you know. It's not my jam. I'm sorry if I broke someone's heart with that. Uh, I will. I'll do. I'll do some videos on that. I'm not trying to be, you know. I get it. People want to want to find out about that, but I, I I feel cheapened when people want to find out about that. That's all. I feel like like you mean you're not here for me. <laughs> So I feel a little bit like betrayed. That's why I don't talk about it because I'm like, I don't, I don't want to talk about it anymore. If that's all you want, if all you want is to find out, 
you know what I really what I'm really gonna say, guys, is that is that that information is so cheap online that it's it's just cheap. But but me getting me, it's very difficult. You know, it's very difficult. There's no one else online but me. Talking about art, that's cheap. You know, what colors did you use? What? How did you do that? That that's that's it's like it's cheap info. It's all over the all over the net. But me, baby, me, you can't get me anywhere. Me, you can only get me here. Look at that. Boom, baby. I'm I'm very good. Mucho bueno. And now I'm gonna come up with a palette knife here. You know, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. And then a little bit of that. How about that? How about that? And then... There we go. Now we're talking. Now we're getting in the groove. The way that I like to paint and what I try to teach people or share with people... I'm not much of a teacher. Come on, guys. Let's keep it real. But uh, if I was, you'd be, you'd be here for, like, art stuff. If you're here, it's because it's because you love me. You love you love what I have. All the nonsense that I say. If you're still hanging out with me, it's because you love my nonsense. Come on, keep it real. <laughs> but um, what was I what was I saying? Oh yeah, um, I, I I like to approach art in a very simple way. That's really me, you know. And 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 simple for me means don't think about See, anywhere you go online, people are going to talk to you about all the other BS about, which is important, right? It's important. Hey, this is how you mix colors. This is how, this is what red means. This is what blue means. And on and on. Anywhere you go online, you're going to hear that. What you're not going to hear is this. Look, pick any color. Don't think about what color you're picking. Don't think about what you're doing at all pick anything and apply it even if it looks wrong or if it feels if it feels like no nah, that's not going to it doesn't matter do it because that's how you start learning how to become loose you don't learn to become loose by knowing stuff you learn to become loose by not knowing stuff not knowing is where the is where the real treat the treat is is it not knowing and so everybody's trying to know. I want to know. I want to know, man. How'd you do that? How'd you mix that color? You know, how, I want to know. I want to know. And, and, and knowing is not going to get you loose. Not knowing is where the magic is. Not knowing how I mix the color. Not knowing how I did it. Not knowing what I'm thinking about the color. Because I'm not thinking anything, really. It's just it's muscle memory at some point. And so I did a lot of not knowing and I continue to do a lot of not knowing in order to truly start tapping into something else, you know, to truly start tapping into what should we call that? Into the, the, the real inspiration. Let's call it that. Let's call it what it is. And the real inspiration may not look very artsy. That's why nobody liked Van Gogh, you know. It, not 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 nobody liked Van Gogh, but but lots of people didn't like Van Gogh when Van Gogh was there. There's a there's a there's a beautiful quote out there that says, "True art does not look does not seem artsy at all." I think it was taken from one of those one of those uh, uh, sacred books. I think it was the Tao the Tao Te Ching, one of those sacred books. But uh, but. Uh, it's illustrating that, you know, that the true art is not going to look very artsy. And and the reason it doesn't look very artsy is because it's it doesn't look clever. It's really it's really what it tries to say. It's not trying to be clever. It has no path. Right? It looks like it does, like I start doing the little drawing and whatnot. That's that's the stuff that just I'm used to, right? But if you've been paying close attention to my to my videos, I have over 1,700 videos here. 
uh, I've been changing it from time to time. I change it. Sometimes I stick too I, I stick too long with the same the same uh, thing. It's because I'm used to it. It doesn't mean that because that's the way that it is. It's just that I'm used to it. But uh, it just changes, you know. It changes, and and the and the path changes because because there's no one way of getting there. If I were to tell you, here's what you do, here's how you do it, then then I create a formula. And if I have a formula, it's not real art. Real art is not formula. Enough said. Bam. There it is. Check it out, guys. Look at that. F and yeah. Hey, look. Here's what I'm going to tell you, okay? This, this and other paintings that I do here are available on auction, guys. Check out my auctions. I'm on eBay. Jose Trujillo. Boom, baby. World's greatest living artist on eBay. Just look for that signature. Sometimes it looks like that because I'm crazy. And sometimes it looks like this. Let me show you. Sometimes my signature looks like that and it's freaking, it's, it's funny. My wife was like, dude, sign it correctly because people are asking. And then sometimes, most of the time, it looks like this. Trujillo. And then I wanted to do like the Picasso thing there, but then, then I stopped doing it. And so I don't. I don't do that anymore. It's just Trujillo. Boom. But sometimes it looks like that. It don't matter how it looks like. What matters is that it's mine. That's all that matters. Hey, amigos, take care. Be cool. It's Christmas. Oh, it's not. Is it Christmas? Yeah, dude. It's going to be Christmas. Yeah. Tomorrow it's going to be Christmas Eve. Yeah. My, my family is mucho mexicano. So, um... We celebrate Christmas on Christmas Eve. That's that's when Christmas is for me. <laughs> I'm gonna eat all kinds of yummy stuff. I'm gonna start with some tamales. That's where I'm gonna start. And then we're gonna start moving into all kinds of other awesome stuff. My sisters are making some some gordita. All kinds of man. Mm, yummy. All right, guys. Take care. Talk to you soon. Peace.